It looks like four, right? But wait till you see the twist. Almost everyone glances at this and confidently says, oh, easy, eight minus six is two, and inside the parentheses, six minus four is two, so two times two is four. Done. Feels satisfying, doesn't it? But uh, that's exactly where the trap is. This little problem, eight minus six times parentheses six minus four, looks innocent, but the order of operations flips the whole outcome. Let's slow it down and see what's really happening. So the question is, 8 minus 6, parentheses, 6 minus 4. When you look at it casually, your brain loves to simplify in the most obvious way, just doing subtraction left to right. That's what tricks almost everyone. But remember PEMDAS. That's parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. It's not just a fancy acronym. It's the key to solving expressions the right way. Parentheses always come first, so we start there. Inside the parentheses, we've got 6 minus 4, which is 2. Okay, now our equation becomes 8 minus 6 times 2. Here's the part where people go wrong. PEMDAS tells us multiplication comes before subtraction. We don't just go left to right yet. We must handle that multiplication first. So we calculate 6 times 2, which is 12. Now the equation is 8 minus 12. Simple subtraction now, and 8 minus 12 gives us negative 4. Yep, negative 4. Not positive 4 like everyone assumes. So the correct answer is negative 4, not 4. Crazy, right? It's wild how just following the wrong order changes the sign completely. It's like the problem is designed to make your intuition fail. Your brain sees that bracket and instantly wants to multiply after subtracting first because we tend to read from left to right. But PEMDAS reminds us multiplication and division come before addition and subtraction. And that tiny rule completely changes the game. Imagine if you were calculating something in real life, like money owed or change left, and you flipped the order. You'd be off by the entire direction of the number. So next time you see something like 8 minus 6 times parentheses 6 minus 4, pause. Don't rush. Handle the parentheses, then the multiplication, and only then subtract. It's a neat reminder that math isn't about guessing. It's about structure and sequence. So the correct answer is negative 4, not 4. Crazy, right? Think you can outsmart this one? Leave your reasoning below. Maybe you've got another clever way to explain why so many people get it wrong. I'd love to see your logic in the comments.